Hey YouTube, this your boy FPS COD Zombies here playing some Kino Dead Torting. And for a change, instead of playing on P, I mean, instead of playing on the Wii, this time I'm playing on PC. Sorry for the glare, my webcam was making my gameplay lag, so I'm still recording on the 3DS. Uh, but I'm probably gonna turn the uh, brightness down on my screen so it can look a little bit better. And I'm not planning to go far anyway. I was just planning to get enough gameplay so I can get gameplay on this channel. But if you want to see some of my other COD Zombies gameplays, go to my second YouTube channel. I put it in the description. It's um, www.youtube.com slash Shannon Robinson PSP. Which I really need to change the name because I don't have a PSP no more. But that's besides the point. We're talking about Kino de Torton. And for the record, I do have Black Ops 2 on PC. I'm eventually planning on getting it on the Wii U. But for right now, I'm just going to put my Steam account name in the description. If you want to add, play some Black Ops 2. You know, the usual. But I'm still going to do my strategies in Kino. And... I'm going to try to figure out some strategies in Pentagon 5 because honestly in Pentagon 5 I cannot find a spot where you can just camp out and kill all the zombies. I know there's a some kind of table glitch on the first part of it but I don't feel like using glitches I just like to play straight forward and if I go down I go down. Ah stupid zombie. Two, three. And if you haven't noticed yet, I'm trying out this trash that I learned from um, Spider Bite, you know, from Next Gen Tactic Zombies. He does this thing where he shoots the zombies six times, then knife them. And when you get to round two, that really helps and it also helps you build up more points. So I really suggest that strategy if you really want to get a lot of points to help you open up more doors. Oh, here I go to turn down the brightness real fast. But as soon as I find a program that won't make my gameplay lag, then I will actually stop recording on my 3DS. But right now on my laptop, my gameplay lags if I try to use my webcam to record. Like, probably next time I try to use the webcam to record, but... I'm telling you, my gameplay will lag, and I just got raped by that zombie. And that's one other difference I learned between. Oh, that was just me sewing down, playing with an Xbox controller on PC. But what I learned from the zombies on the PC compared to the zombies on the Wii. The zombies on the PC are more responsive because the zombies on the Wii, if they hit you once, they would just reset their animation and try to get you again eventually. But on the PC, they just the zombies just go straight out with it. We're just going to kill you here without resetting. Just getting another quick revive so I won't go down. Well, I'm going to go down, but that's besides the point. Opening the door, trying to hurry up and get away from the hellhounds. Oh wait, it's not a dark round. Okay, it's another round. And the other reason this video is called Train Failed is because I epic failed at doing a rape train on the stage. Earlier when I did that, I made it to round like 16 or 17 or 18, something like that by myself. But I got knocked down here on round eight. And then one scene the video will skip because I'm still learning how to use Window Movie Maker. I deleted my old video editor that I was using on my second channel. Or on my first channel. So yeah, I'm really learning how to use Window Movie Maker. But really, if you want to see me go really far, I suggest checking out my other channel. Like, I 
think I posted this, but I'm not for sure yet. I made it to round 25 on Kino de Tor 10 by myself. The only reason I didn't go further is because the Ray Gun and the Thunder Gun ran out of ammo. And yes, they were both packed a punch, so I mean the Portal X5 and the th Juice Cannon ran out of ammo. Just looking for some Thomas. Oh, I got lazy here. I just didn't feel like walking over there to see what they was doing. I just shot the zombies. Oh, for the workout, I went to Best Buy this week. They was having a Black Ops 2 tournament. I made it to like third place in the tournament. It was fun. Was I would have won because I would have got three games for under sixty dollars for free. Call of Duty Marathon. That what would happen. <laughs> yes, Nikolai. We know it's your vodka, and we hope to see you again in Black Ops Two. Oh, and for the record, if you um, haven't played the map Nuketown Zombies, uh, this is actually an uh, interesting Easter egg that turns out um, Nuketown Zombies taking place the same time as Moon. And you know this because after every four or three rounds, you hear a quote from Rick Tarpin. And if you go back to Moon, the quotes he are saying are at different parts of the Big Bang Theory Easter egg on Moon. And then after Rick Thomas get done with the his Big Bang Theory Easter eggs, you end up hearing him um I mean you end up seeing the zombies' eyes turn orange from blue. So that means uh Samantha just now lost control of the zombies and the zombies had I mean and Rick Tom had taken control. Oh, and there's also another Interesting thing that happens in the town zombies. You also see, hear Marlinson's voice each time you um, knife the safe room. So that means one of the transit characters are actually in New Town Zombies. Not playable, but they in there. And now that gets you wondering if you might get to see the old characters again, or is the side maps that you don't get to play as Misty and the gang in will probably consist on what happened after Moon. So I'm kind of interested in seeing what the future zombie map packs have hold for us. And if you play on the map town, you look on the hotel sign, it will tell you that it spells out Moon. Because all the letters are missing and it happens to spell out Moon. So we don't know, we might end up going back to the Moon. And here is my double rape train fail because I tried to do a rape train two times in this part. Yeah, I was already getting surrounded at this point. And I think in a minute I decide I'm finally going to try to kill some of the mobs to get some points. Yeah, nigga, like we made a miss. We just missed up on this rape train. Yeah, see, the zombies was about to surround me. I barely made it across that. And I was really thinking it's time to kill them off because I'm, see, I got screwed. And I'm, I don't know how that zombie got me. It probably got to the side of me. I know it didn't come through that door, so. I'm just really thinking, what the heck? But I get back up and try to get some more kills, get away from the zombies. The bad thing is that was probably my last quick revive. I think it was. And I know if I try to go any of those ways, I wouldn't make it. So I have no choice but to open that door. No matter how much I played on the Wii, my natural instinct would tell me, don't do it or you'll die. To listen to my instincts. I made it though, but not in the next like 51 seconds of the video or 51 minutes. 
Uh, this the video where part of the video where it cuts off to why I started because the 3DS give you 10 minutes. So I went over the 10 minutes, so I had to start from right here. I'm just now about to buy Juggernaut. Yeah, that tells you how I keep my money in order. But this was my last attempt at doing the rape training because this was my last shot. I used up all of my creepy fives before this round. And this is round eight. And this kind of made me sad because I normally make it a lot farther if you check out my other channel. Like that's I'm just came across from the teleport. But anyway, YouTube, I am out. Peace. Comment, rate, subscribe.